Hi and welcome to Techniques on Tuesday. I'm Debbie Yeomans and I'm a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. Today I would like to share with you the two-step stamping technique and a, a slight variation. So I'll be using the High Tide stamp set. Um, it is a two-step stamping set and it uses images that will layer on top of each other to complete the image that you're trying to or wanting to get. So this is my cards. This is a normal way of doing two-step stamping. And this is my variation where I've used a window sheet for a second layer. So let me show you how I've done that. When using two-step stamping, it's a I like to use my Stamparatus. So I'm just going to bring that in. And I've already cut out a piece of Whisper White cardstock with the stitch nested label dies. And I've placed the images that I am using onto the different hinge of my Stamparatus. So the first layer I'm going to ink with Crumb Cake ink and press that down. And lift that up. Oops. One great thing about the Stamparatus is if you don't quite get a image that you want you can just push it back down again and we've got that and then at the top we've got some the grass which with I'm going to ink with pear pizzazz so you can see that I'm getting this and then I'm going to lift my hinge and spin it around and on the other image I've got my memento black and I'm going to ink up the outline of that and stamp again So that is two-step stamping. So now let me show you how to do a variation of that one. So we start with our piece of white like we did before. Place that in place. Turn these back around. And start with my crumb cake ink. Give that a good push down and then I'm going to put the pear pizzazz on just move that magnet a little bit first whoops put some pear pizzazz on the bottom like that now I'm going to move that one away for the top one and I've cut out the same shape with some window sheet this time so I'm going to put my window sheet down and switch the top bit back around again. But this time, because I've got the window sheet, I'll need stays on ink. So I'm going to ink up the other side of the lamp with the black stays on ink and put that onto the window sheet. Just give that a good push down and it's a bit sticky so you might need to peel the window sheet back off your stamparatus and I've got my top layer then on here and I'm going to put it so I will need to use some Tombow liquid adhesive glue to stick that onto there and it gives me just that little bit more of a 3D background compared to this one. And obviously you're going to see a little bit of adhesive. So I've cut out a frame with the copper that can layer over the top like that. So that is two-step stamping with a variation. And that is my completed card. Thank you for joining me today. I hope you have a go.